Hey, this is Vegeta, the Prince of All Saiyans, and this is SSJ Goshen 4. Her figures are over 9,000! Hey guys, this is SGoshen4 here, back again with yet another reaction video on, I'm so excited for today's episode, Dragon Ball Super Episode 66. We get to see Vegito, Super Saiyan Blue, in action. So I cannot wait to see it right now. Like, I am really psyched. Like, I can't wait. So, without further ado, let's start watching this episode. And I can tell already that I'm gonna be freaking out. Goku's Kamehameha, that's right, let's see what damage that can do. By the way, I'm watching this on Funimation now. Pretty good, quality's awesome. Let's see what kind of damage this full power Kamehameha can do. Wow, it's huge. What? That's freaking awesome. What? Damn, it wasn't even half the size of Zamasu's damn attack. Goku must be like so worn out. What? The hell? His face is like melting off. What the hell is going on right here? Like I'm really confused. Oh shit. Oh shit. I like he's like electrocuting him right now. Ooh hoo hoo. Ooh hoo hoo. Rage. Rage. Damn, why is his face like that? Why is it melting? What the hell is going on here? What the fuck is this? What the fuck? Exactly, what is that? So is he not immortal? Like, can he, can he melt? Is he absorbing, like, energy? Like, what is he doing? Like, what the hell is this? Wow, so he's only half immortal because Black is not immortal. That's why he's half, that's he's kind of melting. Mm, so there is a way they can defeat him now. What the hell? He has, like, a Hulk arm? Like, woo! Vegito! Yes, I've been, like, pumped. I, like, I've been waiting for Vegito. Like, it's awesome. <laughs> When Vegeta said that, he's like, I'm never gonna do that again. Vegeta like hates that so much. He hates that. He's like, oh god damn it, it's not again. Are they gonna explain it finally? Oh. Oh, finally. Now they explained it because they did not explain it in Dragon Ball Z. They did not. It was just like a plot hole where like, what the hell happened there? That's good. That's nice that they actually explained something to like, say why they defuse. Like, people were making like, uh, a theory that it was because of boost stomach acids or something like that. No. So here we go. That's this is the official thing. If you're not Kai, you could all, you, it only lasts one hour, so. That's interesting. That's a good thing that they explained that. And Vegito is here. Woo! I love how Vegito has like, like that like brownish tint to, like brownish reddish tint to his hair, I really like that. Still like Vegeta better, but Vegito's pretty freaking awesome and freaking Super Saiyan Blue! Yes! Sorry, I've been waiting for that, I know. Hey, I'm not overreacting, like I'm being serious, this is freaking awesome. Wow, look how beast Vegito is, he's just so like... Nonchalant, look at that. That was good. I like that. That was like how they explained the fusion thing. So I do remember it was like a like they never explained that shit. Like they just defused and it was like okay, I guess we we're supposed to just roll with it. Good thing they did that. I love seeing this. It's freaking badass. He's so full of himself. It's ridiculous. Ha! Ha ha! Oh, he felt like you talk so damn much. Fuck. I love how Vegeta's so cocky though. It is really awesome. This is intense as hell. This is like my favorite like part of Super. Like I'm really loving this. I like the action. Look at that. Ooh. Animation looks pretty cool here. I really like this. Vegito's got this. Like I can I can tell Vegito's got this in the bag right here. No, Vegito's got this. Like you're so full of yourself, honestly, freaking Damas. And he's like a fucking idiot, like really. <laughs> I'm serious. Ooh, Spirit Sword, got you, bit. Damn, that's so cool. I've been waiting to see the Spirit Sword. Honestly, I've been waiting for that. Two people can play at that game, right? He's so annoying. He's so freaking full of himself. Talks a lot of shit. He really does. The Moss talks a lot of shit. <laughs> I don't think he's so full of himself. Like. Oh god, oh my god, <laughs> look at his face! <laughs> uh, he's probably like, you're such a boss, what the hell? He's probably thinking that. What the hell? But he's able to like grow now too. 
So he put his emotions into a form. Boo, I don't want to see the kids. I mean. Oh, what? That's really cool. He was able to make a new sword? A sword out of his energy? <laughs> That's weird. Final Kamehameha. Freaking love this. Like, Vegito's such a badass, honestly. Nice. Boom. Right there. Got him. What? Oh, crap. Oh, no. Oh, crap. He used all oh. He forgot about that one. Damn. The more power you use, the faster it goes. That's right. Trunks. Yeah, he made like a sword out of his energy. Trunks is so badass. Like, he really is. In Super, he's such a badass, honestly. He's not giving up. He does not give up. Even though he knows he's not like Super Saiyan Blue or it has no like god training, he's still at it. Like, he does not give up. It's pretty awesome. Very determined. What the hell? <laughs> now what? Is he like sinking his energy like with the people of Earth? Like sinking it to like feel their emotions and feel the power and like um, gain the power <laughs> through that? Look at that. This is epic. This is freaking epic as hell. What did he make? Like a spear bomb? <gasps> oh, it's like a spear bomb kind of thing. Is he God? Like, like what, is, what is going on? He has the energy from everybody. God, you see my face? Like, it's so epic. So, so... Sorry, I'm kind of like speechless. So, Trunks saves the, saves the day and defeats the Moss for... So everybody teamed up, gave their energy to Trunks, he felt it within him, and used it to defeat the Moss. And we thought that Vegito was going to be the one to defeat him, and he was not. He just battered him up a bit. That was insane. Like, honestly, like, that. what a twist. What a twist there. Like, I bet none of us thought that Trunks was going to, like, do that. Like, we thought Vegito was going to be there and beat his ass, and then... You know, and probably defeat him. Wow, this is so cool. All right, guys. So that was a, such an intense episode. Like, so many mixed things. So many, like, thoughts going through your head while watching that. So first off, I love how they explained uh, how Goku and Vegeta defused in Dragon Ball Z in um, the Boo Saga. And um, it's funny because people thought that it was because of Boo's stomach acids or something. They made up some theory as to how they diffused, you know, because they've always said like, oh, once you fuse with the earrings, like, you're stuck. So that's nice that they explained that because there was never an explanation. So apparently, only if you're a Kai is um, when you are stuck together. So that was nice to hear. Also, I love seeing Vegito in action, even though it wasn't for a long time. It was just for like basically half of what half of the episode, a little bit more. But still, like it was still awesome to see him and as Super Saiyan Blue. That was freaking badass, and he was kicking ass. But of course, the fusion did not last because of um, them using so much power, and it just made the time go shorter and shorter. So still cool to see him though. He did kick uh, Zam Zamasa's ass a bit, and then. Trunks came and just, he tapped into the energy of all of the, the humans on Earth and created like this aura, this power, this, he felt it within him, he created like a, a spirit sword, you know, with his energy and the energy of the people and he just slashed freaking Zamas right in half and defeated him and None of us thought that that was going to happen. We thought Vegeta was probably going to save the day. But look, Trunks actually did it. He actually did it, which was nice. I, it was a cool twist. Like, I did not expect it. I love that Trunks actually didn't let anybody down and he did it himself. I mean, he did have help of the mortals, you would say, or the humans. But, I mean, they kind of did it together then in that sense. I mean, it wasn't just Trunks because the humans also, you know, put their energy in their their passion into it so they can defeat Zamas. So that's really cool. And um, the preview shows that that's it. Like he did save the day. He did defeat Zamas. So we shall see what's the next adventure now. Like what's gonna happen next? I mean, it doesn't really show much from the preview of uh, next week. So 
What do you guys predict? Do you, do you think there's gonna be another R coming? Do you think they're gonna have the other tournament that they talked about? Hmm, we shall see. So let me know what you guys think in the comments and what you thought about this episode. And until my next video, guys, peace.